Hey guys, it's me, the Game McFly. Um, yeah, I'm back for another video, and it's a pretty psyched one, because if anyone knows me at all, I love Night in the Museum. <laughs> like, I mean, I imagine, yeah, for most people, they see, like, all the movies as just pretty run-of-the-mill, like, family comedies. Right, supposed to be have people like Ben Stiller and Owen Wilson involved with it. But, um, as of two hours ago, which I completely missed, which I don't know how I missed it, but I, knowing me, I probably did. Um, <laughs> yeah, but as of two hours ago, Fox, right, and Disney just uploaded the first trailer to the new movie, the animated one. They announced, like, I think like two years ago during their investor conference. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Night in the Museum. Kamara Rises Again, or basically the animated movie. Um, the trailer came out for that, and Brimma's main premise is Larry is going on Brimma's summer vacay and needs someone to replace him. So he hires Nick, his kid. <laughs> right, yeah, you got Nick who comes in, become a premise replacement, uh, right, night, yeah, night guard. I know, I'm just trying to process my thoughts. <laughs> right, yeah, but Nick comes in, replacement night guard, and we end up with, and of course the main thing is the fact of, apparently, got loaned from the Smithsonian, Calvin Ra, which, yeah, Akman Ra's older brother, who was the main villain in the second movie, he's back, and we get a whole thing of, of course, essentially, I imagine still trying to do the same thing he did in the first, yeah, in the movie, the second movie, which was pretty much raise an army and conquer the world, even though, right, still doesn't click in his head that the second the sun comes up, he'll basically be turned to, you know, what most of the MCU was turned into after Thanos snapped. Uh, <laughs> yes. Uh, but yeah, that was the thing. But you get a couple of new people in this. A um, couple of new things. One is Joan of Arc, which, yeah, I forgot the name of a book, but I remember there being a Night in the Museum book, right, and not connected to the movie. But yeah, it was based around Nick trying to stop this other guy, right, like this new dude from like stealing the tablet's power. But mainly, yeah, he was pretty much running around with Joan of Arc, who was pretty much in the same capacity that Amelia that Amelia Earhart was with Larry in the second movie. Um, but you'll get an entire new voice cast, at least for what it sounds like. Um, I imagine the one that I would have to deep dive into more is the new guy that got playing Teddy, because Robin Williams passed, and yeah, that was the thing. Um, right? Here's hoping it goes better than Will Smith as the genie. Uh, <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's hoping it goes better than that. Um, but I love, yeah, I like that idea, and no more so. Uh, if you know anything about Joan of Arc, more importantly, how she was executed, uh, the joke they make at the end of this is gonna hurt. Oh, it's gonna hit a lot differently. <laughs> um, just saying that. But the other one is Seth, or they call him Seth because that's how it's spelled. But Seth, yes, the Egyptian god. Who, if you know anything about pretty much the origin story of Osiris, or right, or not Osiris, right, um, right, yeah, pretty much you have to bring in an actual Egyptian god for this. Who, just the way how he's written, I don't know, might just be me, but I'm immediately going to you how he's being portrayed with James Woods as Hades from Hercules. <laughs> it's a thing with me, I don't know. But point being, this is going to be really fun. Comes out on December 9th. It's going to be a blast. <laughs> for me. Um, but yeah. I guess that's my thought on it. Um, can't wait to see it. Um, right. I imagine even just the fact of like. Because of course if you've seen the movie. Larry's. Yeah the end of the third movie. Larry's not actually in the night guard anymore. He's kind of retired from that. Um, but I guess. Of yeah, course. I imagine it's from the motor again. This would be a nice, fun thing, or just another night in museum thing to hold us over. Because it was also kind of the announcement, the same investor called that there was going to be another live action movie coming. 
which I'm hopeful for. Because again, I love Night Museum, right? And I'm just hoping with this, Disney's able to do more stuff with this. Like, I don't know. Something in the parks. <laughs> which that might be a completely different video on its own. Um, so yeah. Um, that's my thoughts on it. It looks like fun. Again, right, I love the movies. They're literally some of my favorite movies of all time. Um, so yeah. And also, sorry about the lighting. I'm, this is a new light rig thing I'm doing. And the sun is basically a neon light at this point. So, <laughs> yeah. Sorry about that. But, right, dang it, yeah, I guess that's it. <laughs> so, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, YouTube stuff, right, the bell, hit that thing. If it's working, I don't know. And, uh, and, uh, bye.